Yeah. Our reporter Catherine Nash joins us now in the studio. Catherine, tell us a bit more. Why has Ofgem decided to take this action? Well, Tessa, this is actually a reaction to a review that it carried out into looking at how people on prepaid metres were treated and dealt with by suppliers. Now, some households, of course, opt to pay for their energy in advance because it's a way of better managing their bills. But what this review actually found is that thousands of people were being switched on to prepaid metres without their knowledge. So in some cases this happened remotely via the use of smart meters. In other cases, people came home to find people on the door waving court notices as well, which is something that Ofgem has said is simply unacceptable. Mm. Now, earlier on today, I spoke to a lady called Tori. She said her family had been struggling with their bills. They weren't offered any help at all by their energy supplier. She came home to find two men already installing a meter into her house, wow. and she had no idea it was going to happen. My in-laws were there and they, they, they weren't elderly at the time, but they were older. And I felt, I was shocked and I felt so ashamed because they didn't know that we had, um, we had problems financially. And it's just meant, you know, that ever since then, we, we would find it very hard to switch suppliers. We pay higher rate than anybody else. So that's Tory's story. What, what have Op Ofgem actually said? Well, Ofgem have said that it's going to take a really tough stance on energy firms who, who flout the rules and on firms that offer very little advice as well. It's going to name and shame them and it might even take legal action for some of them too. And Catherine, you've got some other energy bill news for us. Some people are going to get some money back this evening. Yes, indeed. Now, you might remember at the end of last year, some households signed up to a trial where they could receive discounts on their energy bill in exchange for not using energy-rich appliances, so things like tumble dryers and washing machines between a set duration, set time in the day in the hope of reducing demand on the national grid. Tonight, it's happening for real, so if you've signed up for that deal, you've got a smart meter between five and six, you could save some money. And we understand that the same could be happening tomorrow night as well. OK, Catherine, thank you.